Hey, today, this is my latest vlog video. I uh, just wanted to update you on how things go and talk a little bit about something that I like, conventions. I recently had uh, the opportunity last week to go to the uh, Cooperative Baptist Fellowships uh, General Assembly in Washington, D.C. That's their annual meeting convention. Uh, they have it in a different city each year. Um, if you want to find out more information about that organization, I'll have their website in the uh, information on the side here. It's thefellowship.info. Had a great time uh, also while I was there because it is a convention gathering where people from all across the country are involved. Also means that bacteria and viruses from all across the country came into play and, of course, I picked up something. So here it is three days later. I am still sick as a dog. Really started feeling bad like the day after uh, I got back and uh, haven't been a whole lot better since. Drinking lots of orange juice. Uh, so if I sound a little funny, it's because my sinuses are totally clogged and everything. So I apologize if the sound quality is not up to my high-level standards, which you know are just so high. <laughs> anyway, <sighs> conventions. Like I said, I had this opportunity to go. Cooperative Baptist Fellowship annual meeting. For those of you who may not know, Cooperative Baptist Fellowship is a group that broke off from the Southern Baptist Convention back in 1991. I'm a member, I'm an ordained minister uh, in that organization. Had a great time at the meeting, went to D.C. Uh, we had great workshops, great meetings, great exhibition hall. Saw lots of old friends, made some new friends. Had a great fun time, came home, did a lot of networking. And it was a great experience. Uh, but of course, it's easy for me to say that because, I don't know about you, but I'm one of those people that love to go to conventions. I don't care what it's about. I could probably have fun at a convention because I've realized that all conventions share pretty much similar elements. You know, they're all the same. I don't care whether it's a religious convention, like I went to a comic book, sci-fi convention, boat convention. Sometimes they call them shows or general assemblies or whatever, but it's really all the same thing. you got your same elements. You've got a large group gathering in some particular point with some common interest, whether it's religion, fantasy, boats, homes, whatever. Then you've got certain elements. You'll have meetings that usually uh, pertain to the organization. You'll have workshops or little how-to clinics, depending upon your item. We call them workshops at the Cooperative Baptist Fellowship, but sometimes they're how-to things if it's a home improvement or it's those little event forums like you know, when you go to the comic book convention where, you know, meet so-and-so and, -so and uh, you know, learn how you too can be a writer, you know, stuff like that. And so all of those things are common. Also, you always have the special guests, uh, you know, whether in Cooperative Baptist Fellowship meeting, it was like Jimmy Carter and Tony Campala, whereas at the Star Trek convention, it might be, uh, you know, William Shatner and Leonard Nimoy, you know, so you're going to have special guests. You're also going to have the uh, the dealer room uh, where you have you know that big area with the, like the 500 booths of these different organizations or companies you know trying to sell you stuff or provide information and that depends you know at, at our convention they call it an exhibition hall but it's the same thing as your quote unquote dealer room at your comic book convention or whatever it's a bunch of booths people from different companies and organizations you know trying to provide you either with information services or product. And, you know, it's just a really fun way to network. And then, of course, also another important aspect of conventions is the party, uh, which, you know, is something that you'll find at all, almost all conventions, you know, people getting together. I want to have a good time. Uh, of course, you know, at this Baptist meeting, you know, it wasn't like too extreme. You know, our, our idea of fun was an ice cream social and maybe a pack of booth for the uh, young leaders group. But we did have some, uh, you know, nice little socials afterwards and 
not like your hardcore parties at some of the conventions that I've been to, which I won't get into. But, needless to say, what I'm trying to say is that pretty much conventions are all alike. No matter what the topic uh, of the convention, it's pretty much all the same thing. And either you like that or you don't. Some people really like that. I, I do. I do. Um, some people don't. And, you know, think conventions are the most boring thing on the universe. But if you're into that, like I am, it was it's a good thing. And Anyway, I had a fun time. So that's sort of like my comments for today. Hoping that I'll feel better soon. Uh, always a risk when you go and gather with a large group of people that you might pick up something, which I did. But uh, I'm going to finish it up here. It's been enough rambling. Uh, I know this is a short vlog, but just wanted to let you know Excuse me. I'm still alive, trying to survive, drinking my orange juice. And until next time, I hope you have a good day. Check out the uh, website for the Cooperative Baptist Fellowship and uh, check us out. Have a good day.